Welcome to Compline for Thursday, March 3rd, 2022. Compline is the office that completes the day. It has been called the bedtime prayer of the church. The mood of the entire office is one of peace and tranquility. Both speaking and singing are done quietly. The service begins and ends in silence. Be still, aware of God's presence within and around. O God, come to our assistance. O Lord, hasten to help us. The Holy One, grant us a restful night and peace at last. Amen. Come down, O love divine. Seek thou this soul of mine, and visit it within thine own adore glowing. O comforter, draw near, within my heart appear, and kindle it thy holy flaming bestowing. O let it freely burn, till earthly passions turn to dust and ashes in its heat consuming. Let resurrection light shine in my darkest night and clothe me round while my path illumine. Amen. O most holy and beloved, our companion, our guide upon the way, our bright evening star, we repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love, O God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness. Light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are, have been, and shall be, is known to you. To the very secrets of our hearts and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame, burn into us. Cleansing wind, blow through us. Fountain of water, well up in us. That we may love and praise in deed and in truth. We are a forgiving people. Thanks be to God. Our reading comes from Ephesians Chapter 3, verses 16 through 19. Out of the rich treasures of divine glory, may God strengthen you inwardly with power through the Holy Spirit. And may Christ dwell within your hearts through faith. And as you are rooted and grounded in love, may you, with all the saints, be able to grasp and to know the breadth, length, height, and death of Christ's love that goes beyond all human understanding, so that you may be filled with all the fullness of God. Amen. O Lord, support us all the day long of this troublous life, until the shadows lengthen and the evening comes, the busy world is hushed and the fever of life is over, and our work is done, then in your mercy grant us a safe lodging, and a holy rest, and peace at last. Amen. Join me in the prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep in the Lord alone, 
we are safely rest. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. May the divine help remain with us always, and with those who are absent from us. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Amen. Canticle of Simeon Lord, you have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior whom you have prepared for all the world to see. A light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. Brothers and sisters, the God of all grace, who has called us to eternal glory in Christ, establish and strengthen us by the power of the Holy Spirit, that we may sleep in grace and peace. Peace be with you. Amen.